What's up? This is Squire2448 with a Farming Simulator 17 mod review. And today we'll be taking a look at a truck, semi truck, trailer, mower, and a tractor. So, up first, we'll be taking a look at this 87 Chevy flatbed. This thing looks pretty cool. The wheels have a lot of detail. The grill looks awesome. It does have strobe lights, license plate. It's a crew cabin. Now, for the flatbed, you could have a gas tank, fertilizer tank, or a seed tank. You could have both or just the gas tank, which this one has. It does have strobes in the back. Really nice looking hitch, LED lights, and it is a dually. So, this is one awesome mod. So, we'll hop on the inside. It does have straps. As you guys can see, three of them, which is pretty cool. Let's check out the turn signals. Does have brake lights. All the lights do work on this vehicle. And take a look at those headlights. When you press home, the LED lights turn on, which is a pretty cool feature for this truck. You guys can see it has some in the back. Goes a top speed of 100 miles per hour. Reverse lights are added in. And it also has a very detailed interior. You guys can see it actually shows that the turn signals are on and this looks awesome for this truck and great job to the creators of it I will actually have the link down below in the description and it is a YouTube video link where you guys can download it but we'll take this for a spin this thing handles very nicely which is awesome and all the links to all these mods will be down below in the description and let me know what types of videos you guys would like me to do with them but up next guys, we'll actually be using this truck to look at the service trailer. This is a very interesting trailer, so we'll attach to it, then we'll walk around it. And I think we'll also keep the uh, lights on. So you guys can see, this is a very interesting trailer. It almost looks like the in-game one, but it has a fuel uh, hose. And very nicely done with that. You guys actually saw when we detached it that the lever went up and down, which was good. It has a jacks and gas tank there, so that's a pretty cool feature. We'll just see how it tows. That's awesome. Very cool trailer, and I'm very excited to be using it. Maybe we'll add it to the public works, something like that. But up next, guys, we'll be taking a look at this Peterbilt 388. It's a custom one. This thing looks pretty cool. Awesome wheels on it. The uh, lug nuts are very large. You guys can see it has really nice fenders in the back. Two giant gas tanks on it, and the lights are at the very bottom. So we'll hop in. This is color changeable. Now you guys can see it can open up the front doors, which is also interesting. You guys can see both doors open up. We'll check out the lights, uh, the ver reverse lights. Everything works on it. And that's actually a pretty cool feature that those lights open up. So on the inside view, working steering wheel shows that the hazard lights are on. Everything like that. And also shows that all of the lights are on. That's awesome how you could put all these down. And then you could actually open up the hood. It has a camera up top here, which is pretty cool. Take a look at that engine. That's pretty cool. So we'll turn. It looks like the propeller, the fans do not kind of work. But we'll take this for a spin. Wow, this handles really well. And it goes 52 miles per hour, so it's overall a very fast truck. Up next, guys, we'll be taking a look at this Fent 820 TMS tractor. This thing looks very cool. You guys can see a lot of detail, a beacon light. And I think we'll be featuring this in a farming sim uh, let's play video, which is on the channel every Saturday. But take a look at those hazard lights. All the lights do work, and you guys can see it does have the fog lights, beacon lights, everything like that works. Now on the inside view, there is IC, so if you press space, let's see what we could do. Let's take a look. So we can't really do too much, it looks like, with it, but around back, yeah, it looks like we can't do too much with it. Not sure exactly what we can use, but it goes 32 miles per hour, and up next, guys, we'll be taking a look at this uh, three-point attachment mower. This thing looks pretty cool. It is very, very small. It's a RC150. Looks awesome. Has chains. So we'll be going over here and testing it out. We'll lower it down. You guys can see it actually is a very small one, but it does a job and it even leaves a trail behind. So it's a pretty cool mower, and I hope you guys enjoyed today's mod review. I will be doing many more once more mods come out. Thanks for watching, and subscribe for more.